so tomorrow being expiry i thought it will be a good idea to do uh, to try and analyze nifty's levels so i went to the nsc website and i keyed in the, i went to the option chain page if you need this url all you have to do is you know google nsc option chain and you will get it so if you recall yesterday we were discussing the 12100 strike price and we saw that there was a lot of call writing and the and the open interest at the end of the day was uh, something like 14 lakh and odd you know so today the market went up and uh, and the market went up and the open interest came down the out, at the end of the day 6 lakh 53 thousand calls got covered and that's natural because when the market goes up calls get covered because the people who write the calls they get scared you learned that yesterday right so what about the scene for tomorrow how do we predict the scene for tomorrow what we must do we must check what is the maximum number of oi and what is the maximum change in oi for for which strike price both for calls and puts so we are looking at 12200 and we see that you know that 5 lakh 36925 uh, calls have been written and the outstanding position is 18 lakh 23925 uh that means these people the guys who wrote these calls 5 lakh 36000 they think that in spite of the index uh, index closing at 12220 it may not go up much tomorrow so nevertheless let's see what's happening on the puts you know when you go to the puts for the same strike price um i'm getting the outstanding as 22 lakh 17000 675 which is much more than the calls okay so the writers are not afraid to write 12200 puts they feel the market will go up okay and today a whopping 1564125 puts have been written this implies the put writers are really really very very bullish okay they even wrote five lakh uh, lots for 12150 so they are really not bothered and then again for 12000 even for 12250 they have written 456000 whereas for 12250 396000 calls have been written so you i guess you can say that 456 and 396 evens out but from 12150 and 12200 put trading that suddenly the indication is put traders are feeling the market will go up tomorrow the writers are feeling the markets will go go up tomorrow this is how you analyze now will the writers be proved correct there is something we got to do a second a second a second check on so i usually check this emerging markets uh, uh, etf it's called ishares msci emerging markets etf it gives you a hint on what the uh, fis are doing whether they are buying in emerging markets or uh, they are selling this is a very hot Emerging markets are very hot. It's on a risk on mode. So EEM, you know, as you can see, it has opened gap up today, and later on, later on it fell, but is recovering now. So check this in the morning. Check whether the gap has been filled or whether it has gone up further. This will give you a clue whether markets will go up or come down tomorrow, right? Finally, one check I'm doing is I'm checking the advance and declines ratio. You know, today 854 advance is 964, and the market went up today. it tells you again and again that we are in an arrow market you know i'm sure that many of you will be having cash stocks which are not going up even i do and the large caps are going up it's a more of a large cap play so this is one hint of caution that whatever you are doing square up fast and don't keep positions hanging for a long period of time you know we i mean uh, there are lot of stocks that go up in the morning and i've been watching in the fno uh, section also they go up in the morning they look very bullish and then they react for the rest of the day you know after 10 30 11 so be careful and with that i'll stop you know so this is how you basic idea is that this is how you interpret the interpret the call option put options uh, the levels for the nifty and bank nifty also you can try the same thing the same thing will work in fact for any stock it will work so this is how you do it and yesterday we learned how to gauge change in oi So with this I'm going to close right now and uh, I'll catch you in the next video bye